kind of a genius. I figured out that a twin size mattress can fit in your Ozark Trail one person hiker tent. So, there it is. Now, I've wanted to put this tent up indoors for a while, but it's always like hard because it, although it's a freestanding, it can be kind of loose everywhere, especially around there and there. But if you get a regular twin size mattress and you just stuff it in there, it fits perfectly. It's absolutely beautiful. I love it. But, um, yeah, it's, I'm impressed with myself. I slept in it last night and it felt like I was camping, but I was inside. <laughs> um, yeah, I'd recommend you do that. And if it's like a, if it's got good amount of spring inside the mattress you can kind of bend it a little bit not too much but a little bit to get it through the door <clears throat> and I did my measurements with them and it fit perfectly it's almost too good to be true um, I really didn't expect it to fit but here we are and the mattress kind of shapes it out like if you have the mattress out it'll be all loose on the sides and everything but the mattress kind of works like the stakes and it pulls everything out so that it's all stretched out and you can be in there and have a lot of room so yeah i thought i'd just make a quick video of that but i also want to make a video about steaks real quick so these this steak came with this tent it is very thin and flimsy and you can already tell that it's bending and I have lightly used it like very lightly and this steak comes from your local target for about what was it I think I got it for six or seven dollars. You can get six of them. Uh, six steaks come with it. And these glow in the dark. And they're pretty strong plastic material. I'd get these if you just like camping outdoors, nothing much. Like, But if you're backpacking and stuff, one thing I'd suggest, replace these your your poles with some aluminum poles and I wouldn't use these stakes if you're gonna be like in the outdoors and like extreme weather um, sure they'd be fine regular camping and stuff but these will break a little bit I'm I'm sure I haven't used them too much um, I got them a while ago. I just haven't made a video on them. I wanted to, but I haven't. So, yeah. You can see it's bending. These glow in the dark. Let's start with the pros with this one. Pros, it'll hold up for a, a decent amount of time. But it'll start bending and breaking. Pros. Glow in the dark, very sturdy plastic material, sharp, sharp enough to penetrate into the ground. Pros, it's, let's see, a pro, All since it's metal, it can, like if you lose it in the ground, I've done this before, you get a rock and you start pounding in the ground if you lose it and you wait till you hear the clinking with this one it'll sound like you're hitting the floor or just a rock so you kind of screwed a con for this one this will break and they're kind of 
hard to see in the daytime. But let me try to get it to glow in the dark for you real quick. There you go. We're in a dark room. I just put it up to the light. So if you leave it out all day, staked into the ground, and then at night it should glow. Um, I think that's the end of this video. Um, subscribe, comment, like, share, turn on notifications, and I will be posting more in the future, I promise.